the news today. Brownies made with cricket flour and sprinkled with ants. <laughs> Will eating insects save the planet? Let's put some more on. Yeah. Well, these kids help save our at-risk native eels. They got pretty hungry and they decided to eat my finger. But they didn't, they didn't get it. I'm Mime Sumi and I'm reporting for Kia Kids News. There are a lot of ways that we can protect the earth, but did you know that eating insects is one of them? Here's a cow and all the space it takes up, and grass it eats, and fertilizer and water it takes, and methane farts it does. Compared to a cricket, it's obvious. You might think that it's a cricket, but I think it's a cheetah domestica. This is Dave from Bird Barn, and this is Turbo, a bearded dragon. Bearded dragons love to eat crickets, but then again, they are lizards. So, what do crickets taste like? Mmm, crickets, delicious. Oh. Lizards love to eat bugs. No surprise there. But what is surprising is that if more humans ate insects, it could help the environment. I do not want to eat a sister turkerka. Now there's a company that makes insects into food. <laughs> Why should we eat insects? In terms of nutrition, they're really high in protein. So they're about 68% protein for crickets. And that's much more protein than actually in beef. So do bugs poo less than other farm animals? They definitely create less waste. Thousands of New Zealanders say that they wouldn't mind eating bugs. So let's see about that. Here's one we prepared earlier. And it's delicious. Let's go meet our hungry testers and see if they like our delicious insects. It's good for the environment and it's good for you. So who wants to try some insects? <laughs> Brownies made with cricket flour and sprinkled with ants. Yeah! Yeah! Let's put some more on. Yeah! Are you ready for some ants? Yeah. What would you rate it out of 10? 10. 10. 10. That's pretty good. You know what can sting you? A Mesobuffus martensii. An edible scorpion. Here I go. <laughs> Next we have a tarantula. <laughs> Ooh, a chocolate covered Hablobloma albustriatum. Tarantula! If you eat the chocolate covered tarantula, you can have some insect <laughs> mixture as well. Disgusting. Oh, I might throw up. What are the ants by themselves like? It tastes like nothing, just crunchy. It tastes like coffee beans. <laughs> Do you think that you'd like to try ants again? Yum! Ants! It's actually yummy. I like ants with my cake. and some people have enjoyed it. What do you think about eating insects? I'm Emea Sumi from Kia Kids News. My name is Zeta and I'm a student at Fuenling School. We have some pretty weird teachers. They're slimy and if you're not careful, they'll bite you. Come meet them. And here they are. Tuna kufarifari longfinned eels. This is the man who brought them to our school, Dave Cooper. What kind of eels are these? These are longfinned eels. 
So why are these eels endangered? They're under threat because of the changing land use. So people drain swamps and pollute rivers and barriers to migration because these guys migrate off uh, by the islands, the Pacific Islands, and spawn. When do you think the eels would be ready to leave? When they're ready to migrate off and spawn, you'll see their eyes go big, big and blue. And that could be a year, could be five years. Are there any things that we should be doing right now to help them grow or get yeah, ready? Feed them and keep doing what you're doing. Look after the tank. How do you know that our eels are healthy? Well, they're nice and active, which is a good sign. And the water quality are looking good. But the main thing is they're feeding. If they weren't well, the first thing they do is go off their food. Yeah, well, while you guys break up the food like that, do you know why you break it up? So everyone gets some. Yeah, everybody gets some, that's right. Otherwise, only the big and bossy eels would be getting the big lumps of food and the other guys wouldn't get any. So when I last fed them, they got pretty hungry and they decided to eat my finger. But they didn't, they didn't get it. So what do the eels eat and what eats them? When they're small, they eat insects, but as they get bigger, they eat other fish, uh, including other eels, and they'll eat uh, anything that falls in the river. As far as what eats them, when they're about the size of these eels, shags and other birds will eat them, but if they get a little bit bigger, nothing eats them. So they're the apex predator. Do they ever eat things on land? Yes. Really, really rainy nights, they slither along on the grass and eat worms on the grass, especially in farm areas. That's a good question. This has been Data Khan reporting live for Kia Kids News from Pointingland School. Thanks to New Zealand On Air.